Today is National Taco Day, guys. By the time this goes up, you'll still have time. Uh, Betos is open 24 hours. Go get some tacos. And we have come. All right, last weekend we had Creative Women Minicon. It was a great success. Thank you to everyone who came down and showed their wares. Thank you to everyone who came down to support the ladies, to talk to them, to purchase from them. We've got their art on the wall for the rest of the month. Through October, they're all for sale. So if you like something, just talk to us. Uh, you can take it home with you at the end of the month. So lots of comics this week. Uh, oh, graphic novel discussion reading club is this Thursday dealing with Rachel Rising, Volume 1. This Friday night, we are showing Star Wars, 8 p.m. when we close, the original uncut theatrical version. So make sure you come down and see it. And look at this. this the trades are ridiculous this week. Wicked and Divine, low. You guys, come on. This book is amazing. I've got volume one and two on the shelf, and number three comes out. You will not be disappointed in uh, Remender with that book. Headlopper, finally out. We've been waiting for this one. Uh, look at that. That is a fat trade. Uh, $20. Trees, Warren Ellis, this is out. And this is a, an original graphic novel for Squirrel Girl. This is going to be my first venture into Squirrel Girl outside of New Avengers. I'm really excited. Everyone says it's adorable. She looks adorable. I'm, I'm ready for it. Top three this week, you've got Moonshine. It is the team that brought you 100 bullets. Azarello, Rizzo, uh, West Virginia, bootlegging days. The mob is going down there to try and get their cut. And, of course, things don't go the way you would expect. And there are wolves or werewolves. We don't know. A uh, little mystery there, Jessica Jones. Uh, Maliev and Bendis. How can you go wrong that way? Shade the Changing Girl. You guys didn't read Doom Patrol. I got some more in over there. It's the Young Animals line. Doom Patrol was the first one. Shade the Changing Girl is the next one. You guys should really check it out. It's kind of what Vertigo... Uh, they changed the name from Vertigo to avoid the Vertigo title, but it's what Vertigo used to be and uh, should be. So check out the Young Animals. All right, let's dig into this puppy. There is... I don't even know how I'm going to catch up with all these guys. I'm behind already. I will admit... Last couple weeks I've been playing StarCraft. Uh, I should not be playing StarCraft, but I beat the first one. Uh, StarCraft 2 Volume 1. Moving on to the Zerg, but I'm going to take a couple weeks off before I do it because i got a lot of comics to read. Champions Marvel has been pushing this really hardcore. It's all the kids, the kids who are opposed to Captain Marvel. Things have not been going well for Carol lately. Death of X, when they started up Marvel at number one again after Secret Wars, one thing that we knew had happened is that Cyclops was dead. The mutants were decimated. We never knew why. This miniseries uh, will tell it all. Look at that. That's a match made in heaven, guys. I love DC's science fiction uh, space adventures. And you got Hawkman and Adam Strange in one book. A little crime noir at Angel City. William Gibson, the sci-fi novelist. Uh, probably one of the best. His Archangel book and also his comic book introduction. Cannibal. Eclipse did really well from Top Cow. Number two is out. Why not? Look at that. He-Man and Thundercats. Come on. Red One from Dodson. This is actually number four. One and two came out like two years ago. Three still on the shelf. We have some twos in the back issue bins. One you're going to have to find on your own. New Warren Ellis over there. Trigger Man. Goes hand in hand with that Rizzo Azarello. Look at that. Andrea. There's two covers for this one. I had to get the Arthur Adams because I love Andrea. Glenn and Andrea are my two favorite characters in the comic book. Not necessarily on the television show. Um, Michonne's probably my favorite character on the television show. Everlast, uh, that, or Ever After, Everlast. Ever After, that is a continuation of Fables over at Vertigo. Dead Man's got his own miniseries. Got some Uncanny X-Men action. Doctor Strange, we're setting up a movie group. Uh, take a peek at the Facebook page. You can find out where we're going, when we're going. Uh, come in and watch it with us. It's a lot of fun. You can watch me eat an entire large tub of popcorn by myself. Amazing Spider-Man. Invincible Iron Man. That's just sad. Yeah, but it's so good. I don't eat that day. I save up. Maybe I'll get some Twizzlers, too. <laughs> I love that cover of Harley Quinn. God, that's beautiful. This has been a great book. It's probably been my favorite outside of the Green Lantern stuff. The Superman, pre-52 Superman, and his son taking over the role in the new 52. Justice League. And look at that. Apollo and Midnight are back. Why? Where are they showing up? There's only one way to find out. We'll see you guys this Thursday night for the Graphic Novel Discussion Group. Friday night, we have our movie night. Original Star Wars, theatrical cut. Check out the Facebook page. Follow us on Instagram. Look at Twitter, Periscope, Snapchat, YouTube. We're everywhere. See you guys in the shop.